What's up guys, it's Mining Office and I'm bringing you a late night special today. It's uh, 9.35 on the East Coast here and uh, T-Rex Miner released a new version which includes a LHR unlock, all right? Um, so I'm not gonna go through this extensively like I do normally. Go check it out, it's version 022.1, all right? And they send a link uh, to this guide here which gives all the details, it's called the LHR guide and it gives all the details of how to tune this. So it's LHR tune with a value between zero and eight. All right, so uh, yeah, I'm gonna keep it nice and short. We're gonna go over the rig, and this time I'm gonna test this out with the RTX 3080 I have in the rig. So I'm gonna modify the batch file to get, uh, or keep all the other cards mining Ravencoin and uh, this one off it. And uh, we're gonna open up a new instance of T-Rex Miner. I'm just gonna make sure it's the right version I have. I have the auto update in the uh, batch file, so theoretically I think it should be. We're just gonna make sure it's the right version. And uh, yeah, we'll get hashing on uh, the RTX EVGA 3080. Okay, you guys can see version 0 0.221. Um, I started this without the 3080. See, it's just 3060 Ti's. And I'm gonna start a third instance uh, First, just stock settings, no unlock, then stock settings with unlock, and then overclock with unlock. Uh, so we'll go in uh, three progressive steps like that, and we'll see how far we can push uh, this 3080. So yeah, let's get to it. While I'm waiting for the 3080 to stabilize, I'll just go over some of the important stuff here. Um, so do not set intensity in the batch file. Um, it says also it might take a while for it to stabilize. Um, it pauses for 20 seconds between trying to unlock the GPU. So you have to be patient with this. And it says to not change your overclock settings too much while the miner is running. Um, yeah, it can result in a rapid hash rate drop. So we have to be careful about that. And also for 3060 Rev 1 cards, there is no special treatment given. So uh, some of the other unlocks we had tested had specific things for the 3060 Rev 1. This one doesn't. So just have that noted. Uh, and yeah, we're gonna go check back with the 3080. For everybody asking, this is the batch file. You can just see it's my first device. Fans at 90, power level at 100, uh, core clock zero, locked core clock zero, memory clock zero, memory tweak zero, light hash rate zero, and uh, auto update, which doesn't really change anything. So let's start her up. This is the baseline for the non-LHR tune, so just LHR zero. We're getting 47.84 mega hash here at uh, 268 watts. Again, we're at 100% power limit uh, just to test this out. So now we're going to try LHR tune 4, which is the recommended one. The hype is building, waiting to make sure GPU is LHR unlocked. So you can see that it's working, resuming mining. Uh, you can see our first hash rate was, uh, our, our first hash rate report was pretty low. Uh, we'll see if it goes up. So yeah. 61.14, I'm liking it so far. That's that's pretty good for no overclocks, no nothing, just LHR4. You can see it, it says it there, sorry, LHR4. And if we look at our afterburner, uh, yeah, okay, it's high power draw because I'm at 100%, but there's none of uh, this craziness we had going with the other miners. It's, it's a flat line, which is what I wanna see. So, so far it's looking promising. It's got me really hyped, even though it's past 10 o'clock now. So yeah, let's let's keep pushing through this, guys. And now we're floating around 64 mega hash. I just made two changes. I lowered the power limit to 85% just to save a little bit of electricity and not like heat up my room to 40 degrees Celsius, you know? Um, and I turned it up to LHR six. So you can see it varies a little bit, right? Um, oh, LHR kicked in. There you go, LHR detected. 3.6 minutes since last lock. Changing tune, six to five unlocking. That is crazy, guys, that is absolutely insane. T-Rex miner, are the best. They are absolutely the best. This is crazy. So I'm gonna let it do its thing for a little bit longer. Um, I'm glad I captured that live. And then I'm gonna get some overclocks going on this. So yeah, let's, let's keep going. So look, we downgraded to LHR5, but the mega hash still keeps increasing and increasing. So now you can see we're sitting around 66. And again, this is just stock settings, LHR6. So obviously look, I can change it back to LHR5. But uh, yeah, we're sitting around 66, that's pretty good. Uh, oh, oh, oh no, oh no, LHR lock. So we're going back down to four where it seems stable. So uh, we're gonna let it stabilize at four. I guess I tried my luck and it didn't work. But uh, yeah, we'll let it stabilize at four and then we'll get some overclocks and see, uh, see what we can get. Okay guys, I just got an LHR lock again. I'm going down from four to three. I wasn't expecting that. So I'm gonna take a different approach here. 
I'm gonna set to overclocks first and then let T-Rex just do its thing. I think I, that might save me some time. So uh, I'm gonna go with that. I'm gonna lower the power limit a bit and just put a bit of memory on it. So let's try that quickly. Okay, so I set 80% power limit and 900 memory and we're getting like 68, 69, 67 mega hash. Um, hasn't been running for too, too long, but I think at LHR3 it should be good. I also changed that obviously. And uh, yeah, I, I might see if I can just reduce the power limit a bit more. 270 is a bit high, but uh, yeah, 67 to 69 mega hash is pretty good for an LHR card, I think. So yeah, or I should say an LHR 3080. So we just keep pushing the power limit down. Um, I'm still bouncing between that 67 and a half and uh, 69 ish. And we're down to 237 watts, that's 70 power limit. So I'm debating now if I should go down to 65 or just try a locked core clock. I think I'm gonna try a locked core clock, uh, maybe 1150. That's what I read would be good. So I think that might be my last test, but already I'm, I'm very happy with the results. So uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's finalize this. Guys, I am very happy with these results. Like I said, I set the locked core clock to 1150, all right? We're pulling between 230 and 220 watts for the same amount of mega hash between 67 and a half and uh, 69 and a half. So I'm, I'm really happy with this. To me, this is the best unlock yet. So big thumbs up to T-Rex Miner. On all my other mining software, I was never really able to reach that 69, 70%. Here I seem to be getting it. Like I said, it's not hyper stable. It varies about two mega hash, but that's more than good enough for me. So yeah, I'm, I'm very happy with it. Okay, so I just wanted to add one more thing before I signed off. Uh, I'm going to let this mine all night, so uh, at least a, a good eight hours, let's say. And I'll update the description tomorrow of the video, uh, letting you guys know, basically, um, if the pool hash rate of this 3080 card here uh, is basically the same thing that T-Rex Miner is showing us right now here on the display. So I just want to make sure that everything lines up and there's no fishy business going on. But except for that, yeah, like I've already said, I'm, I'm pretty impressed with this. So yeah, thumbs up again. To me, this is the best mining software. I'm not affiliated with them or anything, obviously. But yeah, I, I always use T-Rex. You, you guys always see me using T-Rex, so that's, that's no secret. Anyways, if you guys liked the video, please hit the like button. I stayed up super late to make this, <laughs> to make this testing video, so I hope you guys appreciate it. And uh, I would also appreciate if you guys uh, hit the subscribe button to my channel. Um, I'm going to have a, a new card unboxing coming soon. A uh, little hint, it's going to be a card I have not unboxed yet. So stay tuned for that. I have 3080s, 3060Ti's, 3060s, 3070s. So that should give you a pretty good hint here. So anyway, guys, uh, I'm curious to, uh, to check out your, your results. So please post them down in the comments below. I'll be uh, checking that out and responding as always. If not... Have a great night, and uh, I'll be catching you guys next time. Peace out.